In late May of 2014, APFA's beaver expert, Adrian Nelson, headed to the northern Ontario town of West Nipissing to build working flow devices. This small road was regularly flooded out by beavers blocking the culverts. The sound of running water is what attracted beavers to build a dam. An exclusion fence will provide a long-term, sustainable solution. The process is simple. Pieces of galvanized steel mesh are bent and attached into a trapezoid shape. This fencing is lowered into the inflow end of the pond. Fence posts and wooden headers are attached to provide added security and strength to the device. Adrian explains how it will work. So we've just completed our first uh, exclusion fence here in West Nipissing. Um, and uh, hopefully this will provide many, many years of beaver-free problems on this culvert. Um, in essence, it sort of does three things. What we've done is we've taken about a, a three-foot culvert. We've made it about 12 feet by 12 feet by 12 feet. So we've increased the amount of area that they actually have to start damming. Um, as well, you see that it's sort of built on a trapezoid shape here. What this does is it creates a very unnatural angle, angle for beavers to, to dam at. Beavers want to dam against the flow of water, but when they start damming against here, they have to start damming with the flow of water, which is a very unnatural thing for them to do. Um, the other thing that it does too is it pushes them further and further away from the culvert um, and from that sound of running water, which is sort of a stimulus for them to start damming. So when they start damming here, they're pushed further and further into slower moving water where there's less sound um, and there's less desire to be damming. So they just give up on them. 